Hello everybody, welcome to my week five match in Rebel. Um, so I've got a journeyman, I've got money, but you know I'm not gonna spend until I go over 150k. Got got three mighty blow now. Um, this I should have been against uh, vampires, but unfortunately he quit the league. The week four opponent of the vampires got a, got a buy, which I would have loved, but unfortunately I've got to play my uh, my bogey team ignores <laughs> with a yeti, which might just tee off and kill the whole team. So never mind. Buy is buy is indeed automatic XP and uh, money and everything. So it'd have been. It'd have been pretty nice to have just got a, you know, no, nobody dying. I mean, I've, I've already got a few players that I really want to protect. Um, so it would have been good. One second. Hi, I went to Bryden Bay. That's good. I'm happy. I'm happy that he... Um, <laughs> that he didn't go with a wizard, uh, though the bribe might cause more damage, so never mind. Uh, the record is 1 3 lost 1, evil black goat. Um, got hammered by Kenry. Um, the one of the weeks, God, it was just because you know they're just a stronger, a stronger bash team, aren't they? And uh, I think he, I think he got the rub of the green, as it were. Um, Ah, right. Well, that's that's good, isn't it? Being able to receive and make three mighty blow hits. Um, he does only have 11 men. So, fingers crossed. <laughs> Actually be able to break uh, Norse Armour 7, which is... Which is uh, good. Yeah, he was. He, he lost all his first three games, the Vampire Coach, and then quit. Which is it's fair enough, isn't it? I mean, it's... Uh, Blood Bowl is a hard game. I don't know if he was new to Blood Bowl. If he was new to Blood Bowl and using vampires, he was probably going to have a very, a very unhappy time of it, wasn't he? Really, um, that's that's the problem, you know. People say like just choose what you like and stuff, but Blood Bowl's pretty unforgiving. So using a crap team like Vamps is a is a bit of a recipe for disaster for new players. I think I've got a beast man on three. Yeah, Christmas man. We'll try to get a touchdown here. And he wants three cars. <laughs> he wants two cars. He's all right. He needs a cars. <laughs> That's good. That's good. That's good. Um. No, he's got the he's got the guy behind. I guess that kind of works, doesn't it? Yeah, that kind of works. Right. Let's make the safe mark, the safe block first. Hmm. No, let's protect him from getting blitzed. I need to set up against the blitz a little bit, don't I? Oh, I think that's pretty good. Defend against the blitz kickoff result. Get to make my blow blocks. Um, Yeah, right, good. Well, a block with block is uh, is certainly the safest block that I have, isn't it? Um, I do have one block guy, so I have one safe block a turn. He gets the blitz, <laughs> and I've defended against the blitz, so that's good. On the bright side, I did defend against the blitz. 
Mr. Positive. Mr. Positive has defended against the Blitz. <laughs> so, that's something, I guess. Now it's going to get really hard. Really hard indeed. Now that's a frenzy trap, which is good, isn't it? Wow, it's the wrong guy there, in my opinion. No, oh, no one died. <laughs> actually worked out. Actually worked out pretty well, didn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Brilliant. Armor 7 doing something. So I could block him and then blitz him and then uh, foul the Yeti. I wouldn't hate fouling the Yeti. If I block there and blitz there, though, I can get everyone free from a tackle zone. Two D him or Blitz first. I mean he's a little bit stuck, so I could block him and then blitz him, and then I get into him and I still keep people behind. Problem is I don't really want to make blocks out of blocks. I don't want to, I guess the ball's completely unpressured, so I can re-roll if it fails. I mean, he's he's uh, he's under control a little bit, isn't he? The Yeti here, a little bit, not fucking much, but a little bit. Screen, screened out everywhere. Now there's all sorts of frenzy problems for the Yeti. I don't even need to reroll the pickup here, I don't think. No, not on turn one. Turn two, I'll probably have to reroll that. Oh, definitely now it's near the crowd. Turn two to here, turn three, turn four. Five, six, you have plenty of time. He's going to do the old stick us on the sideline play. Not a bad shout with a hundred K, dude. Sorry if there's a bit of banging, Senai's. Senai's doing stuff with it being Sunday. This was kind of a last minute, last minute deal here. I was thinking it's probably worse if he only pushes me. Because now I've got to work hard at frame next turn. If he, if he powered me, I could have just not stood up. Whereas now I've got to do something, haven't I? Oh, Mr. Fashbinder. Oh, man. So the cast was pretty amazing. Mm. 
one, two, three, four, five, and then GFI to safety, or don't hit with mighty blow. I really don't like not hitting with mighty blow, but um. best way to save me isn't it save him let's put him to there and then he blitzes gets the pow and he gets to go one two three and no one two three four five sad to not do the hit with mighty blow or block Sick AV break. Mighty blow would have made it. Would have made it a KO. Oh, I pushed him to the wrong square. Oh my god, I'm a fucking idiot. <laughs> oh wow. Yeah, he was meant to go here. In my head, he was gonna go here, right? So I wouldn't have to make this dodge. Wow. Wow, that was dumb. No, I'm not going to foul the Yeti. He's, he's under control at the moment, isn't he? Frenzy trap. Frenzy traps on. Oh, man, if only I could move this guy away. But... All right. Well, time for a dodge. Time for a dodge that I didn't need to make. Classic. <laughs> See? Now... If I was new to Blood Bowl, I'd say that um, I'd say that I was really unlucky there. But that was that was not unlucky. That was terrible, terrible, terrible play. Punished. You know. Absolutely deserved. Deserved Kaz there. Made myself make a three plus roll I didn't need to make. Just bad sheer bad play. Punished. <laughs> mm. Obviously, I was unlucky. <laughs> Extremely unlucky. But it wasn't, it was just un completely unnecessary. I can't believe I did that push. I don't know what happened. Just if zoned out or what? positive, then uh, you've got to fucking suck it up. Stop bitching like a little baby. And try and fucking play better. I mean, that was the whole reason I pushed him there, you know? That was the whole reason I made the direction of the blitz. So that I could push him to there. So that I wouldn't be based. It was just outrageous. Absolutely outrageous. I don't know what the fuck happened in my head there. No idea. I mean, I'm not sure it was deserved, Fash, but it was certainly unluckiness that could have been avoided, wasn't it? It was unluckiness that, you know, that didn't need to happen. <laughs> oh, man. I don't want to let the Yeti up. I guess I can base him with the uh, loner. I kind of need to make a cage first, don't I? <laughs> I like to blitz with the uh, Mighty blow. Well, 
Right, so we've got the anti <laughs> the anti war dancer cage here. Also just a way to keep my defenseless mighty blow player protected. Um, Alright, let's do this block first, even though it's the unsafe block to see what happened with the push and everything. Now he can face him. He can make the blitz on him. Ha! Up, up, base, base, base. And two casts so far, which is pretty good. And then I want to go back, so I've got the option of where to push him at the moment. No, no, I've got the option anyway. If it's a push, I can go there and if it's a pal here, so. Stay where he is. It is a pal. A glowing with power, so another mighty blow hit there. Oh, missing a missing a warrior for the next game is a bit sucky, isn't it? Means no star player points for him that game as well. Absolutely my fault. I've closed three cards. One from pushing him in the wrong square. <laughs> and then two from just punching armor seven things. <laughs> yeah, whip yourself for mistakes, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, Fash is a bit extreme, isn't he? But, you know, ultimately, ultimately it was my fault. This does let him get them the Yeti relevant again, doesn't it? But then it also means that the Yeti can get Blitz with Mighty Blow as well, so. Six and two threes. Oh, good job he made it three dice. <laughs> but didn't make the follow up three dice, which is a mistake, wasn't it? If you're going to put, you know, I mean, he changed his mind halfway through. Should have made him both three dice. But not the end of the world. Didn't double skull from it. So, you know, staying alive is more important than winning. So, <laughs> with that in mind. Got to go for the seventy-five percent knockdown on Claw Guy, haven't we? Oh, cheeky mighty blow! Mighty blow, making it the air, uh, making it the KO as well. It's pretty good, isn't it, mighty blow? Just quietly. Even keeping the ball safe. Fash would be proud. I guess he could go here as well. Ball still very safe, isn't it? Yeah, kids level is a bit tricky. <laughs> Hello, I done. Um, not actually hopelessly outbashed. I outbashed myself by I chained him free, but then didn't chain him free, and then failed the dodge and cast myself. <laughs> um, but then, you know, beat people up with that with mighty blow a little bit, which is good. 
Yeah, it does give up the Dauntless hit on him. Oh, he fails. Only a one -er. Oh, glorious. An extra, an extra mighty blow punch. Yeah, it was a bit silly protecting the protecting the loner and giving up my mighty blow guy to be hit, but yeah, it was the field control aspect, wasn't it? Sorry, safe block. Get the start with the safe block. Outrageous. Let's push him away from the uh, from the ball. You can blitz him, and then I can two D him. That seems reasonable. Where would the ball go? Just hit him first. No, I can't, he's loner. So he can go there and then he's the, naturally the assist, isn't he? Hmm. Howdy, howdy. And it's still enough to swing, swing back if I want. Incredibly difficult to get the. Uh, in fact, it's probably incredibly difficult to get the surf from here, isn't it? Yeah, a little bit ducky, a little bit. I was, I've been AV zero though, <laughs> but it was my fault. So there were siphons first there, weren't they? Yeah. I always behave more when Fash is in the chat. <laughs> Get them safe moves going. I mean, the fact it was a loner, though, meant that I knew I couldn't re-roll the, re the block. The bad thing about assisting with a mighty blow was the mighty blow guy is going to get punched, isn't it? Me, KLZD, believe it or not. <laughs> <laughs> wow, fouling with an oath! Fouling with an oath! <laughs> Fucking hell! <laughs> Fucking hell! <laughs> Fucking hell! Ballsy. Hmm. Bit tricky to get forward now, isn't it? Do I just herb derp? Base, base, base? Guess I could do.
No, I can't actually massively go to one side. There's a screen there. Out in front. Oh god. Right. Don't fail this. Right, Herb Dirt Base 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 is all there is for it. <laughs> oh lord. Maybe I've been a little bit too safe. Up to now. Because this guy should have gone in there to stop the assist there. I don't know why I didn't. Just thought, don't know what I thought. Wanna? Got a reroll. Maybe I should have done two GFIs. With the ball. That seems fucking stupid, doesn't it? I mean, you're still going to get fucked, obviously, no matter what you do. <laughs> but you're going to get less fucked if you consistently make the right moves, aren't you? No, oh, hits him. Interesting. Looks like the basing's worked. Wow. <laughs> well, yeah, I could have said bad, but um. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't think it was a good. It wasn't a move I would have thought of doing. Um. Yeah, safe moves. All right. I mean, I could go here. That's as far forward as I can get, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five, six. I mean, I didn't have to go six forward. So I could just blitz him and then get everyone forward. And make a uh, cage there. If I just need to get rid of him. One, two, three, four, and then a push is good enough. So he's got to do it first, hasn't he? To facilitate everyone else moving. I could have uh, blitzed down the middle. Um, would have been a good option. But <laughs> um, I wanted to make sure a push was good enough, and uh, it certainly was good enough. Yeah, try doing no moves at all. That's that's fascist go-to play. <laughs> Do no moves at all. If I go here, I just want to jam in here as much as possible, don't I? I don't really want to tag. But then... It kind of does something, doesn't it? What can I run all the way around? Go on, 
I'll just tag him. And then just go for a cheeky, cheeky one dice. So like it sucks, obviously, to keep him in giveaway blocks. But on the other hand, that's three players that can't affect the play now, isn't it? So he's only got three players free and one base. Pretty good half, really. I mean, I should, I shouldn't have. This shouldn't have happened because I should have just clicked on the right fucking square when I when I chained him out. So I should be absolutely hammering him at the moment. Oh, he's got a bribe. That's why he did the foul of the ulf. I've just remembered he's got a bribe. For fuck's sake. The foul of the ulf wasn't completely fucking crazy. <laughs> Calamity, Sam. No, that's a bit harsh. It's a little bit harsh. Um, yeah, I thought it was a misplay. Uh, and it was interesting because I didn't, I didn't think of doing it. So it was a little bit, wasn't it? Yeah, middle screen. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know what you're saying. Yeah, that's the thing. If I if I'd if I'd gone through the middle, I would have had both sides assailing me, wouldn't I? Whereas now he's got to reach out again in front, whereas he could have easily got in front if I'd gone down the middle. I like staying as central as possible, but he could have easily got a bunch of guys in front. Whereas now he's got to actually work to get in front, and I can blitz him down anyway with my eight blow. So. Like, whatever happens, I don't think he can position to stop us here. So just need a push. A push on two dice. I mean, he should have probably dodged him out. Now, now that he can't, he should have probably dodged him out as well. And that would have made it a lot harder if he dodged out. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then maybe a GFI. And maybe not a GFI. Depends if he uses reroll, do a GFI. But probably didn't need to. But now it's just, uh, I can't make it three dice. But um, this is the only dice roll required, isn't it? I need to push from here so that I, I can dodge if I fail. Yeah, I can't make it three. Got it. Push to the right square. Well done. Well done, me. Pushing the wrong square cost me a casualty. No rerolls used in the entire match. I guess I could have rerolled that fail dodge then, eh? <laughs> oh shit! No rerolls used, but the one fail thing caused my guy. Oh shit! That's that's annoying to have the yeti back. Right, zero SPP guys on the LOS. Not really scared of one turner. Thanks, Calamity Sam. Oh, God, but that, that war losing the warrior for the next game. I don't know who the next game after this is. It's not a badly hurt, it's a missed next game. The worst injury because you can't, you just can't apple it, can you, basically? It's not a perm and it's it's not guaranteed to work, so it's a it's a horrible thing to use the apple on. But it was entirely my fault. Pretty pretty bad. Pretty bad that I just I was just zoned out. I don't know why I did that push.
<laughs> yeah, it's crazy how much it fucks me up. No, oh, yeah, I'm not muted. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy. I'm fucking allergic to onions. Must be. It just fucking kills me. Every time anyone cuts them up. You close all doors. <laughs> all the doors closed. Oh man, why didn't he hit? Why didn't he hit with the yeti first? <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I put the uh, I put the loner in the middle because normally people block with a big guy in the middle. Wow, good job he had three dice here. Eh? Got him the pal. Saved him his yeah, he's getting fucked. Now it was a it was a great first half really in terms of luck, wasn't it? Because you know, three guys out. Great. <laughs> Just really bad that I'm down one for the next match and it was my fault. And potentially it could be even men second half here. In fact, I could be down men, couldn't I? There's still time. There's still time to be down men for the second half. <laughs> no, it's not crying. It fucks me up. It's not like it's not like I cry when I do onions. Well, I have I have cried when I've cut onions before, but it's like it's just some kind of fucking horrible allergic reaction. It fucks me up. Hey, bribe gone. Maybe even guy sent off. No, too much to ask. So yeah, I was thinking he had the bribe. So yeah, I was thinking there was a good chance of him removing a player there, like KO or better, and then maybe not coming back. It could have really been, and he could remove someone on the LOS here, and it could be it versus it easily. It's my fault. Oh, damn it. Neither has used a reroll there. And he came back. Right. I've only got two frenzy now, and they're both strength force. There's no point doing a space invader formation. We'll do this though. The guy in six a little bit protected. Yep. So it's a shame because obviously block mighty blows way better than just mighty blow. So now the block mighty blow guy is the one who's going to be getting all of the blitzes. Um, so it's going to get harder and harder to level these two up, but hopefully they'll they'll randomly get something. Oh, cheeky reroll! God, he's got block on everyone. Hello, Dr. Mombosco. VIP, Dr. Mombosco. Or maybe he just wanted the three into three on the uh, Yeti. It's, it would have been three into two if he had taken the ball down, wouldn't it? Can he protect the Yeti? I don't think so. I think the Yeti's going to get spanked now by Mighty Blow. can protect him, yeah, that's that's good enough. With a stun for sure. Oh, 
And on the other hand, it doesn't mean that this guy's going to get punched, doesn't it? <laughs> Glorious. Don't let this sub distract you from the fact that Globo <laughs> just blew a four to one man advantage to average Joe's to lose the ADAA Dodgeball Championship. <laughs> Here at Global Gym, we're better than you, and we know it. <laughs> that was always going to be the uh, the Team Fantastic uh, slogan was going to be Here at Team Fantastic, we're better than you, and we know it. <laughs> Thank you very much, Fudge Nipples. Thanks for staying fantastic. Glorious. I'm just going to leave him down, seeing as I'd fail a 3 plus dodge. And uh, those two are stunned anyway. Fucking hell. Global Gym Purple Cobras. We came in, we came into a tournament like that as well. We were doing the whole dum dum tss thing. <laughs> pretty good, pretty good. I created myself. <laughs> It was a good movie, Dodgeball. I thought it was really funny. Oh, hello, hello, Sun 89. I didn't understand what that was. It's a, it's a pig. <laughs> so it says hi. Yeah. Hi. 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 <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was The Simpsons, wasn't it? Nobody makes me bleed my own blood. That was in The Simpsons that that was said. Pretty good. Oh, two into three. I mean, I would have gone for the three and the two. Impulse ready, gone. Let's see if it pays off. Oh, he gets the pal. And protect his fucking Yeti. Oh, man. Yeah, this, is, this is exactly what I feared. The Yeti just... Just <laughs> soloing my team here. Only got a one-man advantage. As one-sided as that first half was. Thanks to me being an idiot and losing a warrior. Only got a one-man advantage. I'm a little bit tempted to... Uh, to harass the cage. Because I can't really hit the Yeti. Put a strength guy here. And a strength guy here. And men here. Burp, burp. Base, base, base. <laughs> this won't fail. I'm on the right. Burp, burp, burp. Come on, kill him. This fucking Yeti, man. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Yeti. No, I actually meant to put this this guy here, but. Hopefully, a mistake doesn't mean anyone dies. Making a cage for his yay. <laughs> oh, no, this is the ball. Silly me. Hopefully, Blitz is the loner. Guess he's gonna go for that warrior so he can get that guy back to complete the cage. Yeah. Now he really can't protect the Yeti, can he? Hopefully not. Hello, Grindle. Hello, PZL as well. Surely he can't protect the Yeti this this turn. I can. Not if you not if you come the cage, but then, you know. Some dice to hit him in it. One, two, three, four, five. I 
and Canoring Threat. Canoring Threat is a go. Oh, fail, 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 fail. Yes. Oh, Hello, Geeks Wargaming. Oh, come on, fail, 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 fail. Oh, yes. What a glorious one in nine. Um, right, if I was being competitive, I'd blitz this guy and base the ball. But seeing as I'm... Seeing as... <laughs> seeing as there's no point caring about the result, um, I'm going to go for the far more sensible play of busting the Yeti down. And when I say that, I mean trying to bust the Yeti down. Oh. Good. Boom. <laughs> um, that worked out pretty good, didn't it? All right. Maybe it's a bit of an overcommit here. But um got a got a screen and stuff, so it's not so bad. <laughs> yeah, step one, blitz with mighty blow, that's it. Blitz with block a mighty blow, fuck shit up. I mean really if it's a draw or a loss, I don't even care if it's a loss. Like that's the thing, that's the that's what I t well I mean I do care because I I like to win. Um Hello Frank Furter. Yeah? Uh, um you know, I like to win, but really it's not it's not necessary. <laughs> In this kind of division, the more important is to uh, skill up your men. Funny old game, isn't it? Hey, that's him out of re rolls. You can't not re roll that. No GFI, no GFIs now. Well, he's got a GFI with him, but not from the ball. Yep, he was indeed punished. Punishment. <laughs> not as brutally as I was, but still punished. I mean, to be fair, he re-rolled the dodge um, because he had to. I, I, I didn't re-roll that. And <laughs> I can't stop thinking about it because it was completely my fucking fault. I just don't know why I didn't, I didn't think. Like, I thought about it at first to set up the play. Specifically why I didn't blitz with Mighty Blow was so that I could free him. And then didn't free him. <laughs> Horrible. That is a pretty well worked manoeuvre there, I think. No. <laughs> no, he was still, he was fucked out too many things. It would have been really good if he could have blocked, blocked the warrior with him. But he couldn't even make it a one dice. Then he could have come round to, to shore it up. Whereas now he's still left making a dodge, isn't he? So having three guys on him was actually pretty good. Although it, it didn't make this kind of move. Oh, well, he made his three plus. Oh, I hit the wrong one though. Hit the wrong one. I think you should have hit this lad. GFI to hit the ball. Oh, another three pluser. Oh, you dirty dingo. <laughs> um, I could one dice to get a hit on the ball. But I'd have, to, I'd have to fill in this square first, which I couldn't do anyway. So, that's out. Right. 
he can he can come back I think maybe I blitz him which then lets me do this one to get him on the ball for what it's worth which ain't much Oh god, I've, I've had some fucking good dice on the Kazas here, haven't I? Holy shit. Stick him in there. Oh, I didn't fit in that square. Because <laughs> I cast him. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> <laughs> oh well. Can't complain about having someone, can I? No, that's better because that stops a block here, doesn't it? To free him. So now he's he's got dice to roll, hasn't he? Yeah, exactly, dynamots. Ah. <laughs> uh. I still, I, st I don't know. I still got a player like I'm trying to win. I can't, I can't not. But yeah, he's, he's been like you know. I mean, overall, he's he's given us a bunch of hits with mighty blow. So maybe this isn't that lucky, but obviously it feels lucky for me and unlucky for him. This was incredibly unlucky, but then also incredibly dumb because I made the player that I wouldn't have to make the dodge. So. I'm lucky that he hasn't caused any cars with it with a Yeti or anything. I mean anybody could cause cars. He's got a bunch of block games down the right, so. But now without re-rolls, everything's everything's incredibly scary for him, isn't it? Damn. Interesting. Block without block, also pushing him onto the ball. Um, yeah, that was a bit risky, wasn't it? A bit risque. Interesting. <laughs> the classic interesting. Gets out of it. Yeah, maybe you're right, Flash. <laughs> maybe you're right, but still. I mean, it's not that likely to fail, is it? A one dice or a three plus dodge. They're really not that likely to fail. But you really like having the uh, the reroll for them. <laughs> nah, you just. <laughs> Someone say it's a one in three. Yeah, exactly. It's not that unlikely. But when you play Blood Bowl a lot, you get the, you get into the. Uh... You get into the uh, kind of. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's true. That's true, Fash. That's true. Uh, well, it's like the fucking heart, heart surgery, isn't it? Is like one percent or something. My, my dad was gonna was thinking about getting it. I don't know if he got it or not. I don't know if it was the surgery he got or the surgery he was thinking about getting it was like a one percent to die. And I was like, 
That's fucking massive, isn't it? <laughs> it's fucking... That's like a huge fucking percent. One percent chance to die is like... I wouldn't, you know, I wouldn't... I wouldn't want that at all. Right. Can go here, can't I? And... He's too far away. What about him? He's not too far away. Even get to hit the other guy with mighty blow as well. Glorious. I right, can stand him up first. Yeah, <laughs> don't click the wrong square. <laughs> well done. Did not click the wrong square. Go on me. Oh god, you've got to fight Yeti. Unlucky mate. <laughs> Fuck the fuck the ball. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, fuck the ball. It's not that important, is it? Hey, he's <laughs> fucking Yeti too scared, <laughs> too scared to fight Best for God. He doesn't want to. Uh... <laughs> he, he wants no part of Best for God. I tell you. No idea, Frankfurt. No idea. And it might, it might be in the the champs letter Discord. Um, one of them definitely said the other one. Do you want to play? Um. Three turns, if he scores, he gets a level, so that's pretty good, isn't it? That's on <laughs> Unless they pass. <laughs> yeah, yeah, well, I just thought, you know, it, it ties up his players, doesn't it? So I thought it was worth it. Like, I wasn't doing it just for fun, ignoring the ball. I did think it was the right play. Oh, the one guy with block. <laughs> Brilliant. Brilliant, though. <laughs> one guy with block. Oh, Glorious, thanks very much. Sky Blue Money, thanks for the host. You can be my wingman anytime. <laughs> right, let's uh, cover the ball a little bit. Two dice block with block. <laughs> um, I don't want to blitz with Mighty Blow, do I? Because I want to uh, just score with him. So he wants to just blitz. Maybe I shouldn't have done. Maybe I should have gone for the pickup, but then I would have failed the pickup too, wouldn't I? With all those dice rolls. Hey. All right, not bad. That should be a <laughs> yeah, a lot of tosses. <laughs> 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 
fuck storm is now? What's <laughs> the that's funny. Um, yeah, so now he's got a chance of leveling up, hasn't he? Up to 16, that'd be pretty good. This guy then needs to bless. Bless? Bless. Guy de Caron needs to blots, doesn't he? To try and get his level. Oh, hit this guy. Yeah, just enough time, innit? It just worked out pretty well. <laughs> yeah, Best for God is just too good, isn't he? There's not even any point fighting Best for God, I tell you. Right, go there in case of Frenzy Man. Um, go there in case of Frenzy Man. <laughs> and there. And there. And here. Lona can get punched. Good for you, Lona. <laughs> and flat fat can get in for the foul. <laughs> Alright, good. Safe from a Yeti Blitz. Alright. Spark and crotch thotty. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> Next week in the evening, right? Thanks. Thanks, Difwin. Stomping signs. Yeah. Yeah, I mean I had to foul there, didn't it? Just because I didn't want him to hit with hit with claw basically, even if it's an uphill. It's uh, it's better than not getting hit by claw. <laughs> there's, there's some uh, there's some intense knowledge for you oh wow he can base the ball I don't like this play purely because he's still going to lose 1-0 like whether he loses 1-0 or 2-0 doesn't matter to him at all and he could have just died on the dodge of the GFIs The only thing that does is stop me trying to skill this guy up with blitzing his ult. It means that he blitzes instead and he's still got five squares to score. It's about pride. Yeah, I know I'm too I know I'm just... Look, I'm the same, you know. I, I, I'm, I'm absolutely the same in terms of, um, you know, going for the result um, here in, in, in these kind of divisions when I shouldn't care about the results so much. Was there not a dodge? Was it just two GFIs? Alright, it was two GFIs. And he could have failed the GFI and died then. But, um... Yeah, you know, it means... Four, four five, six... I, could, I couldn't have three-diced him. So it's a two-dice without block either way. It just means that I'm hitting a different player and not skilling up who I wanted. But, um... But, you know, like... Alright, it just blitz out the mighty blow. Yeah, exactly, yeah. But, um... You know, I, I'm, I'm guilty. He died. <laughs> well done. Congrats on basing the ball, Hank. <laughs> you got what you deserved, you prick. I mean, look, at the end of the day, it saved his Ulfwerna from dying. So, But it also stopped him skilling up. That's sad times. Um, <laughs> but yeah, you know, it was, it was the wrong play because just literally keeping the guys on the ground was the best play to, um, to just not have anyone die in this kind of situation where... You know, a league you care about your team. Even if the result mattered, he can't change the result. It should have laid on the ground and uh, and not had any more people die. But uh, there you go. It's fair enough. Yeah, foul looks good. Yeah, yeah. Every, 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 anything can happen. You know, any any bot can be a death, can it? In Blood Bowl, that's that's the thing. 
So I'm always I'm always going to foul people on the ground like that when the game's over, and people get salty and say, "Oh, he's fouling my guy," even though the result, you know, even though the match was decided. And it's like you, you've got you've got to. Um, 11, 11 to seven. So we actually got pretty good armor breaks. You know, nearly the same on armor breaks. He got more he got more blocks than me as well. Ah, the frenzy frenzy jacks that up, doesn't it? Um, I just got luckier on the actual armor breaks, didn't I? With seven, with five, five cards from my eleven, and he got no cards from his seven. Um, so mostly, mostly just luck. Though obviously, it was. To be fair, it was their uh, mighty blow guys that got the cards. Um, three cards for flat fart, and two cards for brainless chaos. So it was it was only mighty blow guys that got the uh, got that got the cards for me. Um, so you know they they were they were more likely to get Kaz, weren't they, than his were. Um, let's see how many blocks the block mighty blow made. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven blocks from block mighty blow guy. Not bad. Um, the other one got four. He only made four blocks and made two cards. And then one, two, three, four. Four blocks with the other guy, so yeah. Right. Pretty good. That was a pretty good result anyway, wasn't it? Yeah, overcame the worst possible matchup. Hello, Condor Drake. <laughs> yeah, that was a massacre, yeah. I was I was pretty lucky on the injury rolls. Um unlucky with my dodge, but then it was my my fault. My fault making that dodge. Um Level up could go claw on him actually. That's certainly an option to go claw. And uh, that's an option to go mighty blow on him. <laughs> Maybe block. He's really close to getting claw now, isn't he? Flat fart. Holy shit. 29. He got the MVP as well. Wow. Hopefully next game he can get a Kaz and uh, and get block mighty blow claw. Could even go block on him now. If if seems he's so it seems I'm so close to having the block mighty blow claw. Um, I don't know, Jikai, so the results don't really matter. Um, yeah, I was pretty lucky, Condor, the, the, the blitz, the, the Yeti failing, wasn't it? When you say succeed, I don't know what your definition of succeed is. Not You didn't turn over <laughs> on every block. Yeah, I'm going to go, I'm going to go really high, high damage on this team just to, just to skill them up faster. Um... What's the next game? Amazing men. All right, humans. Okay, that, that's doable. That's absolutely doable um, without one Chaos Warrior. I was thinking now, um, there's a game coming up. Crematorium Crew, they're, they're top of the league, I think. Um, yeah, they were top of the league, 4-0. and oh. So I thought if I was down a Chaos Warrior in that match, just because of my stupidity, I'd have felt really bad. But... Um, no, it's, it's okay. Quite tight at the top, isn't it? Four zero one, three zero one, four zero zero. So pretty cool. Um, yeah, no knockdown. Fair enough. Fair enough. Um, yeah, exactly. Exactly. Amazing men will be a buy. Ah, thank you for that information. Quart quarter May. Um, in that case, without being a buy, I don't want to buy. I don't want to buy my eleventh guy yet. Then do I? So that I've got. Uh, I've only got nine players to get the MVP. Um, so there's more chance of getting the MVP on a guy with star player points. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, exactly. BZL. That is that is exactly the that is exactly the way, isn't it? As long as I've got Claw and Mighty Blow and everything, then I'm the one doing the doing the beating down. And not getting beaten up. Yeah. Will it be on the loner? Will it be on a loner? Will I get loners for a... For, oh, so I should, maybe I should buy two. Oh, shit. I, d I didn't know that that's how it worked when you got concessions. I've never, I've never been in a league that got concessions before. <laughs> yeah, I'd, I wouldn't think you would get loners for the admin decision. That's what I would think, but I don't know. Um, you don't get loners on bye weeks, right? Thank you. Yeah, I, that, that's what I thought. I thought that I wouldn't get loners, but 
you know, I didn't know that because it comes at the adjustment screen, doesn't it? So I thought I wouldn't get loners. Um, and then we'd only have nine. All right, he didn't show up against you, all right, fair enough. So, well, we'll see anyway, we'll see what happens. But um, I didn't do the outro. Right, that was pretty good anyway, wasn't it? Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.